On this episode of Doc Solid TV, the speckled trout are finally here. We're gonna go off, starting off catching them for the first time all fall with our matrix float. We got it attached about two and a half feet. Underneath the float is our TKO shrimp made by H and H in our shrimp creole color. We use the float to make some noise, to sound like a shrimp jumping out the water, to get the fish's attention. And this is how we catch fish throughout this entire episode of Dockside TV. The prior Dockside TV episodes, you saw us using the new Mega Matrix, Sight Fishing Reds, but now it's time to do the speckle trout. And this uh, subscription box from Matrix Shad, this is what you're gonna be getting in the upcoming subscription box that we'll be shipping out October 25th. So if you want some floats, some TKO shrimp, and some new Mega Matrix before the stores get them, subscribe to the Matrix Bait Box and enjoy this episode of Dockside TV. this morning and we're going to see if we can put a few keepers in the boat. There we go. Nice one to start the morning. So what we're doing, let me show you our setup here. We get this fish off. That's a pretty nice fish there. Right, so what we're using here is our oval matrix float and this is a really good one for people that like to use plastic we make a cup one too that one's just like one pop with a big gulp bubble when it hits when it makes surface uh noise so that's good for just one you know one pop at a time when your shrimp's doing all the work when you're using plastic it's a lot of pops but really moving that cork around a lot so i like the oval one for that and what we're using here is our TKO makes this for us. It's our shrimp creole color and the TKO shrimp from H&H. &H. And they make this for us at matrixshed.com. This is a deadly combination under a cork. I'm using about a two and a half foot mono leader. And when you pop that cork, that's when that shrimp falls, it just looks very natural like a live shrimp. It's a very effective combination when popping corks. Nice one here. Look, we just had a little double up action. Camera guy caught one. I got one. Both on that shrimp creole colored TKO shrimp. Excellent day under a popping float. And this time of year, we're right into that transition time where speckled trout are moving from the outside and we have not seen these things in a very long time with all of the fresh water spillway openings and whenever they start moving onto the interiors like Pontchartrain, Lake Bourne, Lake Catherine, Mud Lake places what they're going to look for first when they're silly schooly sized fish during that transition fall 
transition into fall is they're gonna want grassy flats and popping these corks with shrimp imitation baits over these grassy flats. And we're imitating white shrimp right now. That is the key to catching speckled trout. They're gonna go a little bit deeper as water temperatures cool. But right now, while they're transitioning into their fall pattern, grassy flats. This is what you wanna be doing and popping corks over them. Pretty one. Sight for sore eyes. Yeah, I love that sound. You hear that cork? What that cork does, obviously, it's keeping our lure over the little bit of grass that's here. But let me put this fish down. The key to the cork is the noise. That click clack noise, that's making it sound like a shrimp jumping out the water. And in our matrix floats here, they're indestructible with that titanium wire. You can bend this thing, tie it in a knot, step on it, chew on it. It always comes true. You are on camera. Looking for me. I'll get my hand. There you go. Another nice one right here. Oh. That's what happens whenever you're catching a few fish. Those trout with them little teeth, they'll uh, fray that line. So you always want to retie after about, I don't know, seven, eight trout. It's always good to retie, that way you don't lose one. Luckily, that one made it into the boat before the little line broke on our leader. And now we just retie it, tie that TKO shrimp back on in our shrimp creole color and get back into action. There we go, baby. Ooh. This is head shaker. Yeah, buddy. We're going to go ahead and end this episode right here. We still got plenty of good morning bite left. We're going to get in on some action. It's been a long time. You got one, too? Double it up, baby. Another trout. Nice trout, another keeper. Oh, and he oh, just he makes in. it in. Should have camera that fish there. Double trouble, good clip to end this video on using an oval matrix float above the TKO Shrimp Creole. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Dockside TV. Hopefully we have plenty more trout episodes to follow, which we certainly will. And we are excited for this fall run of 2019. Until next time, good fishing.